What's up, everyone? I watched uh, episode one. I have to re-record this intro. So what I basically said, because my uh, intro was interrupted by a whole bunch of noise. Roaming I the continent. Seen the last few episodes, but I think the audio is still too loud. Um, but anyways, hopefully you can hear me. I still haven't edited anything down. I'm doing this real quick because I have to basically, but I uh, rewatched episode one of season two. It turns out I hadn't seen the last few episodes of season one. The last episode I left off on was when he gave the whole spiel of how Bancroft had been murdered, but with the lies. I didn't, I don't remember, <laughs> I just don't remember a lot of this season for some reason, or for season one, and I just, when I first watched it, I liked it, the show, but I don't remember it being so damn high of quality. I guess my eyes for judgment just wasn't as good back then as it is now. But yeah, this is one of the highest quality shows I've ever seen in my life. So it's pretty much my favorite show now. But yeah, we're getting right into the reaction. That's pretty much all I said, I think. I started the beginning of it, obviously. It just went straight to the intro. And I laid there in bed thinking, I better react to this. Hopefully I don't get copyright shit. Ah, Told in the fuck. age of eternal God night. damn, hit my toe. Hopefully I don't get copyright struck for... Um, Technology what? has for, conquered death. For exposing 15 minutes of, of a fucking show. Hopefully that doesn't happen to me. I put my uh, The Killer reaction video for... Um, I put a claim under it or whatever the hell that it's fair use. I mean, I blurred the shit out of it. So, anyways, let's hope that doesn't happen again, over and over again, like it probably will. I'd rather be. I also noticed that um, the black guy from um, Winter Soldier is in this. Um, he's a great actor. So, hate to see the other guy go because I really liked his performance. I only know him from Suicide Squad. I never really cared for his acting, but. <laughs> After rewatching Altered Carbon season one and realizing who that was, that's definitely my favorite performance that he's ever had. So hopefully he does just as good. He will probably because he's a great actor. I liked him as the Falcon. Um, pretty much ends there. Like I don't like any of the Marvel stuff anymore. Like after Endgame, I, I stopped watching him. Tried watching uh, Ant-Man and the Wasp. I was really excited for that when I saw the posters for that years before it came out. And was pretty much disappointed by that. Well, I wasn't disappointed. It was alright. But that was like the last Marvel movie I saw because I've just given up hope on them. And Lizzie was really cool in the end too. Love that microphone. <laughs> My theory, by the way, is I think that the sister is still alive because she said she won't give up. And Quill, I... I can't imagine she wants to really continue living. So we'll, it'll be interesting to see what happens there. And I also want to know if you know any hidden messages that might be in this show that you might have picked up on that I'm not. Because I haven't been able to find too many. It's pretty much surface. They're kind of spelling it out for us. So any sort of hidden messages, kind of like Blade Runner does, I'd be interesting to know. If you know anything, I don't. I haven't watched any reviews on this, I don't think. At least not for a long time. Because I started rewatching. I might as well have reacted to the whole thing because I barely remembered any of it. Which is weird because I remembered liking it. I just didn't think it was as good as Blade Runner. But now rewatching it, I'm almost conflicted. Like, it, it's kind of. It's higher quality. Better graphics, obviously, than Blade Runner could ever have. Still uses a lot of practical effects. It's just one of the best shows I've ever seen. Shit that was working for Bancroft. Losers is him? That's, yeah, that's a new character. She Kovach is off on an epic quest. <laughs> Untraceable credits. I've got more. Mm -mm. You don't stop harassing the customers. Mm -mm. Rogue AI. <laughs> you see an emitter around? I'm clapping the matchbox. She's a good singer. No one? People don't like questions around here. I like the AI better. <laughs> Which one of you is Kovach? Really? <laughs> I don't know Takish Kovach. I thought this might happen. <laughs> <laughs> that might be him, huh? Maybe not completely empty. <laughs> 
wanted to play piano. <laughs> and there's nowhere you can go that isn't haunted. Actually. <laughs> oh, shit. Obviously not. Hang on, I gotta get some water. Also, I didn't realize I was so freaking large. Sorry about that. <laughs> burden in mind that I have recently good night beautiful visuals as always that was the picture that I always see on Netflix that shows like when it's advertising this show it shows that camera upward angle right there that one that you can't do to our ghosts. She's got to be alive still. Kill. Well, that was a quick episode. How the hell long was that? Okay, definitely shorter than usual. That's good for me, so I don't have to edit this down so much, but yeah, obviously I didn't react very much, but I don't know why. I think it's just I'm so numb to how good the quality is and that I'm finally like at home. Nothing really shocks me. It's always going to be good in a sense. But I don't know. I definitely love the show. It's pretty much my favorite show. That, Three Body Problem, and OA are my three favorite shows, but this one is probably number one. I also love Get Shorty, but, well, we know she's alive, I guess. Yeah, that's my reaction. Not much to it, but hopefully you enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching. Take it easy.